Disaster is a phenomena which affects everybody. And India is prone to disaster in many ways. Now, G20 uh, disaster risk reduction meet, group meeting is taking place in Chennai. And we have uh, uh, G20 director Mrinalini Srivasa with us to talk about it. What has been discussed in this meeting? What has been discussed, ma'am? And what is the outcome? So, you see, over a period of eight months, five priorities were discussed. And this is in line with the Sendai framework. And incidentally, the G20 meeting in India on disaster risk reduction was proposed during the midterm of the review of the Sendai framework, which started from 2015 and 2030. It's a 15-year plan. So, during that midterm review, the five priorities. One, we discussed about the early warning systems for disaster preparedness and mitigation. Uh, disaster resilient infrastructure, financing for disaster uh, risk reduction. Then we also talked about how can the national and the international uh, cooperation and international response can come together in the field of disaster risk reduction. And finally, uh, a topic which is sensitive, which is something which the whole world uh, cares about, the environment-based approaches for disaster risk reduction. So these were the total five priorities that we discussed. Uh, at the ongoing uh, uh, you know, outcome that we are still waiting for, ho hopefully by this evening we should be ready with a joint statement. Uh, we are coming together on co-sharing, co-creation of some of the compendium with the best practices and case studies. We are also talking about technical input paper which can guide all the G20 countries on important issues of environment-based approaches, on disaster resilient infrastructure and also compendium on how uh, the, the early warning systems can be integrated at regional level so that the cooperation can also be at the international and the regional levels. I have seen there are many startup companies who are working for this. So, uh, is Indian government or G20 is uh, inviting all those people to take part in meeting and uh, actually uh, talk about their ideas, whatever they are working on with uh, regard to disaster risk reduction. So, as you see that uh, these are the two uh, main working groups which were introduced by the Indian Presidency, the Startup uh, Working Group and the Disaster Risk Reduction Working Group. So, we indeed encourage the startup and the entrepreneurs of this country and elsewhere also and especially in the stream of disaster risk reduction. Uh, but uh, we do not endorse any product but we certainly encourage them to come and this is an open market which is competitive and you know if it helps the general public why not. And uh, uh, the, the first day when we started our meeting in Chennai, we had a fireside chat around the disruptive technologies and their use in disaster risk reduction. We have talked about artificial intelligence, uh, robotics, drone technology for disaster mitigation. So I think there's a lot of scope for the startups to uh, come up uh, in new way, in wider way, and in a greater way to you know not only promote themselves but help in building the community and building the nation in uh, adversities and you know around disaster risk reduction. So this is Mrinali Srivastav who is saying that, you know, startup companies, youngsters should come forward and bring up some ideas, bring up some uh, technology which can help, uh, for, which can help foresee that, uh, you know, hazardous, any disaster and to avoid it, how we can avoid it. With camera person Sinkaran, Ritesh Ranjan, DG News Chennai.